So today has, has a lot of meaning, uh, lots of changes today. I'm on day three here of my campaign, um, three days until I'm in New York City with Betty Dotson and finishing the body sex certification. And today's been a really peculiar day because I have been banned from Facebook for 24 hours. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, so let's see, two women today have decided that they are really offended by things I post. Um, none of it's on my timeline, which is, that's the other part of it that's kind of peculiar because it's in private groups. Uh, one's a secret group. Actually, I think both are secret groups. And these are supposedly body positive, sex positive groups. And in one, um, I had, so today I have begun my period, my menses, and I had blood just like dripping down my legs. Um, got busy this morning. I had just started this morning, so I didn't get a chance to, you know, take care of that. I just kind of went about my day and was wearing a skirt. So um, when it was, you know, at that, at that level of blood, I thought, how cool, you know. Got to take a picture of that, of course. Got to record that moment. And I posted it in a group that was for, um, you know, the people that are period positive, you know, that that talk about this, talk about blood and, and how sacred it is and how beautiful it is and celebrating our menses. So, yeah, within, I don't know, maybe two hours or so, it was um, reported as nudity and I have been blocked from Facebook. As well as another picture that I posted a few days back, maybe about a week back, um, breastfeeding my daughter. And that one, uh, because is it is a, it's a secret group, there was a little bit more showing, but that group is is um, pretty open about pictures. And a woman called it out and said that um, it was inappropriate. So it's it's really interesting, you know. I'm here ready to tell you that third reason why I think that body sex and having women come together in the nude in the rawness, in our authentic bodies, talking about our bodies and our sexuality, why it's so important. And maybe you're not that person, you know, maybe you think, well, I'm fine with my body, I don't need this kind of stuff. But there are so many women who have so much shame and who are hurting and who view our bodies as something to cover up or something to keep secret or tuck away or eliminate or... I don't know. Um, the lines get really blurry when it comes to our body and our pleasure and and the practical parts like breastfeeding or, you know, menstruation. Um, it blurs. And, you know, we we report each other. You know, we get kicked off Facebook. We, we don't talk about it. And that's why body sex is amazing because people can sit around and actually talk about it. And in body sex, in the nude, there will be women who are menstruating. I mean, I can't help that. It's going to happen. Um, since I just started today, and today's Wednesday, Saturday, I will probably still be menstruating. And it's a part of who we are. And a part that I'm not going to hide. And um, I'll use, potentially I'll use a cup, which is what I use normally. Um, but then I might just allow myself to bleed. What's the big deal? It's just part of our experience as women and the part that I celebrate. So, anyway, <laughs> it's been kind of crazy. I felt a little sad. Um, this video will get out there, but it won't hit Facebook probably till tomorrow. Um, and then I also realized that I can also send it to individuals and, you know, also campaign that way. So if you get this, then thank you for watching. Um, hopefully you can see the value of my work. Um, I'm probably going to be a little more caref careful on Facebook. I would really hate to be completely banned from, from the site. It's an important medium to use and, um, you know, I might have to censor myself a little bit more. Um, so anyway, uh, thanks for watching and please help body sex so that I don't have to be censored in that circle. I know I don't have to, even if I do need to in other ways. So, all right. Have a great day. Take care. Bye.